Hey guys, today on the bench, I just thought we'd take a look at this Apple cell phone battery and I swapped this, this lithium ion battery pack out of my wife's iPhone 7. It really died prematurely. I mean, Apple ought to really make these good. I mean, they definitely fail way too early to be a, a phone, you know, even just a couple of three years old. This one in particular was manufactured in 2017. I don't really do cell phone repair videos. There's so many people out there that did do it and people like jerry rig do such a really good job of explaining and doing um doing that so i don't even video me swapping the battery out i used jerry rig's video it was very helpful he was a uh, very straight and to the point and helped me figure out how to go around the edge because i was thinking i could just do the uh, suction cup and pull the um the screen off and separate it and actually you got to go around with either a, a blade or um or a spudger of some type so that was helpful and um but anyway i thought i would do a video with my new load tester a battery capacity tester and i just want to see what the capacity of these batteries are because this one failed in such a manner that's very common with a with the iphone battery failure where it shows 80 percent the next thing you know it's showing four percent you know you charge it back up and within five minutes it's showing 80 percent again you know so it's definitely dropping off kind of quick so i just thought hey we'll uh we'll test it out so i, I have fully charged this thing and there we go 4.2 volts i just got it polarity backwards but we had 4.2 volts and it sure would be easy if we could get a a better connection on there right to, to load test with and of course we can we pull this little end off and we should have some black tape on here and we do and there we go and this should be our positive side i already checked this to save time on video but so 4.2 volts so what I have now, I'm going to bring over this capacity tester and I have it set for 2.7 volts where to cut out and, and this will tell us our capacity. So if I hook up our minus and our plus, the alarm should go off and it does. I don't like that screen. It's small. We toggle it again. If we toggle it twice, we see our 4.17 volts in. And we have no data collection for the time or amp hour. And as soon as we get above about a half an amp, the test will start. So I'm going to go somewhere about 0.7 amp just to make sure that the test doesn't stop. If it does drop down, but it should be pretty constant. So this video is going to be straightforward. I'm just going to let this run a little while and just come back and just see where it alarms at. And how close are we to 7.7? four or five watt hour rating of the specs of the pack so we'll skip ahead and we'll be right back about 11 minutes in it's dropping pretty good so i'll be surprised if it even makes it a half capacity much over three watt hours the way it's looking we'll be back to check on it in a few minutes yeah back now it's been close to an hour so yeah it's not gonna make it even close to half capacity unfortunately kind of as expected so we see we're not quite at three watt hours and we're already dropping below three volts. So it's not going to be long. The test is going to be over. So we do see at the end how it drops off fairly quick. And there we go. Cut the current down. You see how it bounced back really, really quick. The battery is not warm and it's not swollen, as you can see. It's not a swole pack. So I just thought it would be interesting to do a quick uh, test on it. I've always kind of wondered myself when a battery starts doing that in a phone, what the capacity would be. So there we go. This one in particular, uh, 2.77 watt hours when it's supposed to be 7.45 watt hours for this particular model at a nominal 3.8 volts. So that'll be like 2.7 to 4.2. So that'll be like nominal or average uh, voltage of the pack. So I hope you found this video interesting in a capacity diminished Apple iPhone battery on the load test. If you like this video, please like, share, subscribe, and thanks for watching.